Hello guys and welcome to this uh, quick X-Wing video. Uh, I'm just taking stock of my uh, my Rebel fleet and I thought I'd take a second to sort of just talk you through uh, what I've got in my collection and uh, my favourite sort of pilots for each ship. Um, uh, this is basically the entire collection. I also have the Rebel Transport but uh, I haven't got that out because it's sort of packed away somewhere at the moment. So this is the entire fleet minus that transport. So uh, I'll just dive on in and sort of tell you my favourite way to run things. So uh, I have two B-Wings. B-Wings is an interesting ship. Um, I really like uh, this one, Kier Kian Farlander. Um, and his special ability is that um, basically when he gets stressed, he can use stress as a focus. So you can kind of use it as a free action, and especially uh, they can they have some a lot of stress maneuvers. The B wing they can do a two K turn, but their forward ahead four is a stress maneuver. A lot of their turns are stress maneuvers, um, so he gets a kind of focus and a stress on those, which can be quite nice. Um, so yeah, uh, I found him to be quite effective. This one at the moment I've got him set up just as Blue Squadron Pilot. I find that the B Wing is quite a nice ship uh, with that five shields, free attack point. They're a heavy hitter, um, so you don't necessarily need the other pilots. Uh, so, I, you know, I've got him out as a cheap option for one of the B Wings. Um, do quite like 10 Num. Uh, he has, he can, if he gives a critical, one of his criticals can't be blocked. He works well with Marksmanship because Marksmanship works like focus, only. Um, it means that one of your focus results you can turn to a crit instead of just a hit. So if you have 10 numb and that, if he gets one eye result on a hit uh, when you're rolling to shoot, you can get a critical which can't be blocked, so that can work really nicely. Um, moving on from the B-Wings. Z95. Um, I like Lieutenant Blunt. That's who I've got set up on this at the moment. Uh, Lieutenant Blunt, basically I use uh, Z95 as just cheap missile platforms and um, uh, assault missiles are my favourite because they um, they uh, are good at a frantic swarm and obviously as rebels you come a lot against a lot of TIE swarms and so on. You can get a similar effect if you just take a bandit squadron pilot uh, and give it munitions fail safe where if you miss and it doesn't hit you get a second attack with it because um, you really want those assault missiles to hit. But um, Lieutenant Blunt's thing is, even if it misses, it still counts as a hit. So it's a great way to get in those assault missiles to, you know, do damage to things around him. So I like Lieutenant Blunt for that. Corrin Horn, my favourite E-Wing pilot. Uh, there's a bunch of ways I equip him, which I won't go into now, because uh, the video would get ridiculously long. Where I basically just um, set him up for that massive double tap. But he's he's one of my favourite pilots. And I also I like him in the extended universe. Because I read some of those X-Wing uh, Rogue Squadron novel type books. And uh, he's a badass. Uh, two A-Wings. Um, Arvel Crinid. Um, I have a special build I do with him. Where I use uh, one of the cards from the actually the... Um... So that guy's had a bit of a technical difficulty there. Yeah, you can bump into things and still shoot them. And if you give them the Decimator thing, he lowers their agility. Not too good. Uh, but the A-Wing's a bit of a problematic. Jake Farrell, I've done a video on him. Great, great card, especially given push the limit and uh, A-Wing test pilot, so you can take multiple um, upgrades. So there are my A-Wings. Y-Wing, favourite looking ship. I just love the look of the Y-Wing. Uh, sadly, not that good, but I go for Dutch Fander most of the time. Uh, and his thing is he can give target lock to things around him, which is actually really good. If you can give free actions to things, that's always a good, always a good move. So uh, Dutch Fander there. I won't bother going into it. Fat Falcon, Han Solo. Always a favourite. And then this is the X-Wing wing. There's <laughs> a lot of X-Wings. Um, Bobby Clivian, he's got some cool combinations of Astromex where you can double stress things and give stress uh, to other things and he can clear the stress himself. Um, there's some nice builds you can do of him. Uh, sorry, this is the one I've got set up as Hobby Clivian. This is from the Rebel Transport set. Like I said, I haven't got the transport out. This is uh, Big Starklighter. Don't need to talk about him too much. One of the the most popular cards. Um, obviously, if he was running in the middle of this, everyone can only target him. So, you know, it makes everyone else do their work better. It's not, not a no-brainer, really. Great card. Um, next up, we've got Garvin Dreyas, one of my favourite X-Wing pilot cards. 
I love pairing him with Wedge and Swarm Tactics. It's a really nice combination, uh, especially if you have Dutch near them. So him, Dutch, and Wedge, uh, they can get some nice synergy builds with Swarm Tactics, where they can basically Garvin and Wedge can both be target locked and focused, and both firing at pilot skill nine. So, so I, I like, that's a personal little combination I like to run. Uh, who have we got now? We've got let's have a look. Wedge Antilles. Probably the best X-Wing card. Lowest the agility of things he shoots at. Not no brainer. <laughs> There's not too much to say there. Really, really, really good. Um who we got now. Luke Skywalker. Uh not very good, actually. There's definitely better X-Wing pilots to take. Uh I just take him because I've got <laughs> um so many X-Wing pilots. <laughs> uh you know, he doesn't make it into my list very often. Um, but I like him because he's Luke Skywalker, you know, classic. What I'm actually hoping is that um, in the Force Awakens, Luke will fly one of the newer X-Wings, which we'll get to in a second, and then yeah, there'll be a new Luke card for one of the those X-Wings. Uh, and then, obviously, it will say you can only field him, because, I mean, you can field him as a gunner for that, but uh, it will say you can only field him uh, in, you know, one or the other, but I'm hoping it'll be he'll be much more powerful in one of those, and then Luke can sort of come back to the field. Because I mean, let's be honest, everyone loves Luke. You know, you're in a nine-year-old wants to field him. And then these guys, which I'll talk about together, the new X-wings. In terms of aesthetics, I think I prefer these X-wings. Uh, I'm not too sure I like the engine block there, but I do like the blue paint scheme. So kind of undecided, and I've gone for just for the this, 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 sake of this display, I've gone for. Poe Dameron and uh, the most basic, the um, Blue Squadron Novice. So, uh, guys, yet another technical issue. Anyway, uh, they can boost, um, which is really cool. They've got a new type of upgrade, which is interesting and new. Uh, only the one card for it at the moment, but cool to see. They've got better shields, uh, and in terms of points, uh, they're definitely <laughs> much more cost-effective than the X-Wing. Um, so, you know, definitely an improvement, but at the same time, aesthetically, I just kind of prefer that one. So, uh, yeah, I, I don't do enough X-Wing on this channel, really. I'm mainly a 40k guy. So, if you do enjoy this kind of thing, do comment and let me know, um, and I can see what I can do to get you some more. But, uh, yeah, that, minus the Rebel Transport, which, as I say, is packed away, that is my collection. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 <laughs> X-Wings. No, not 8. What was it about? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven X Wings. There we go. Can't count. Uh, Millennium Falcon, Y Wing, two A Wings, two B Wings, the United Five, E Wing, and the Transport. So that's the full collection. Um, let me know what you think of it in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up. I'll see you guys soon with another video. Bye for now.